All right, American Local the General Electric for the uh, Instructional School, 800A, um, 150, page 11, the Excision Systems, uh, Section 2, Excision, excision Systems. Basic system, the Excision System furnished with the current of the field with the traction generator, figure 7, the illustrates the simple um, Excision System with the Excision System of this type of the traction generator would supply the power with the traction motors, but it would be of impossible to control the power because of the no control equipment. It drives with the exciter field current with the current of the battery supply with the f u um, field 1 and field 2 with the exciter, with the, depending on the voltage of the battery with the resistance of the circuit, the assuming the battery voltage consult with the current flow through the field one and while I'm constant, constant, constant with the ignore the slight resistance increase caused by the heating of the field and the resistor of 152 due to the current flow of the figure 57A illustrates the additional control device exciter field with the circuit with the load control real stat 152 with reducing the field one and field two current um, with whenever the generator overload of the diesel engine slows it below the rated speed of the, de the device is project of the diesel engine against overload this uh, also safe for the controlling the diesel engine with load of the control of the real stat of the diesel engine governor Operate with the real stat will described later in the load control section three. When traction generated armature excited with the armature rotating the max, max maximum speed with the current flow with the traction motor would be high enough to damage the motor generator itself through the excessive heating of the high very, um, heavy current with the flow but would also force the motors to develop a high torque with the draw power, draw bar for damage and slippage would also occur. Traction generator load current limit. The these conditions are provided with additional circuit the, uh, control circuit illustrated in figure 8 with the commuting pole um, field with the traction generator has become connected with the block rectifying with the uh, rectifier 3, R3, and the resistor 152 with the exciter field with the control. Circuit, in addition with the um, control circuit with the preventing the set of current flow through the system figure 7 would have been permitted, but the system works as follows. The communication pole of the following field is in the series with the traction generator armature, therefore the armature current with the load current will pass through it. The current with the flow with increased voltage drop of the CP field increased um, proportional of this. It can also prove the application of the OMLOM state with the voltage is equal to the current method of resistance, and if it exists with the current flow with the generator armature will pass through the traction motor in the CP field with the 500 amperes resistance of the CP field with the uh, two thousands of an arm, then voltage for the CP field will be, will be 1 volt. All right, voltage equals current over the resistance 500 times 0 0.10,000 to 500 times 10,000 is the voltage of 1. And the current double the CP field voltage will be double the 1,000 over the 2,000 um, of a um, Resistance of a volt is equal to 2,000 volt, 2 volts. Further increase generator cost with the CP field voltage rise to the table to uh, table two. Your generator current is at 500. Your CP field volts are one um, 1,000 volt current and 200 2 volts, 2,000 current. 4 volts, 2,500, 5 volts, 2,550, 5.1, 2,600, 5.2, 2,750, 5.5, 2,950, 5.9, 3,006 volts, CP field volts. Let us assume that the desirable to prevent the generator with the current exceed with the 2,500 amp of the control circuit with the figure of the 7th will do this for the automatically reducing current flow from the field 1, field 2, field of the exciter with the generator current with the flow with the rise of the 2,500 amperes, reducing the exciter field with the current with the exciter with the output with the current with the generator the field current will be reduced. To, uh, this will lower the generator current flow for the safe maximum of 2,500 amperes. Assume the following values excite, um, exciting the circuit, circuit devices. Battery is 6 volt, field 1, field 2, field resistance is 1 ohm, 152 resistance equals 5 ohms. By ohms alone, normal excitation circuit with the control, control circuit control flow may be developed, um, may be found. The current equals the voltage divide, divided by the circuit resistance. One ohm in field one, field two, reserved plus five ohms is 152 equals six ohms of the circuit in resistance. Um, current therefore the equals six volts is divided by the six ohms is six point over to one. Six over one is equal to one amp of the current flow. With the, to find the normal voltage field one and field field one and field two of the exciter um, and the and the 152. Uh, Resistant arms, the voltage of it is minus the current times the resistance. Field 1 voltage is minus 1 times 1 or or 1 volt. 152 volts time is minus 1 um, times 5 is 5 volts. All right, um, looking at this, you see the generator CP field coming from the motor and also the winding, um, the field windings um, of the ampedine exciter with them um, show the um, field 1, field 2, and the... Uh, Current resistance, current resistor load, rheostat, and the uh, 120 battery. All right, generally load current generator output field. The output curve, um, curve is and uh, too much of field, but the current is like too low of load generator over the output underneath the output curve. Um, load control function general power adjusted to match the engine output from B to C is your load control function general power output is matched to the engine. And where C would go to D, it would have been too much load or current. Um, 
All right, you're to the motor. You have the CP field and low current with a, with a uh, resistor of positive and negative um, going for real stat one, real stat, re, real stat three, field winding one and two, and um, resistance 125, 120, 125 on, on the battery. All right, output voltage um, when underneath the generator load of um, A and B, um, you have too much field current. On the bottom side of C and D, the load would be properly limited. Properly limited. When generated load current limit limit added to the excitation system. By adding the two voltages, we get the six volt with the battery voltage itself with the tube with the exciting circle. The 152 volts should be raised for the 5.1 with the field one is winding through two and field winding two. One and two with the voltage would be forced down to zero point nine tenths. Um, because of the sum of the two volt, these two voltages will actually equal the battery voltage. The CP field volts rise to 5.1 volts and 5.1 volts in previous press across with the resistor of 152 with the cover of the field and resistors connected together with the real um, rectifier 3 will be la later, later prevents the normal 5 volts of the 152 from being impressed. Across the CP field with the CP voltage field is below 5 volts. The figure 9 illustrates the action of the water system in which the check valve C permits the flow of the water from flow of water from the tank A to tank B, but not vice not vice versa, even if A is empty but is full. All right, this shows A and the part C, which was uh, your check valve. All right, water going from A into B, um, whether or not the check valve prevents flow from B to A. Pressure from A to E, A, A to B equals B, no, no, no flow yet. And um, pressure from A to exceeds the B, um, exceeds B, and water flow from the A, B through the check valve. All right, R3, the rectifier, works with the little check valve. The watering system permits the CP field voltage of the rate of the voltage of 152, but whenever the CP full volts exceed with the 5 volts, not, will not permit the 152 volts of the CP volts, even if the 152 volts are considerably higher than the voltage of the CP field. CP field voltage will not um, reach with the 5 volts and generator with the current of the 2500 amperes table 2 with the generator current with the volt, volt value with the CP field voltage will equal the voltage of the 152, the equal voltage, nothing that will happen to the 152, but if the generator well current will rise to 200, 2550 amps CP field volts will rise to 5.1. This would voltage increase to 152, raising the ladder's, volt, ladder's voltage to 5.1. As this forces F field 1 and field 2 um, voltage to reduce to 1.0 to 9, 9, 0.9 volts. The exciter field voltage decrease, drops the exciter output of the main field, uh, also drops the force generator current to reduce to 2550 RPMs for the safe maximum value of 2500 RPMs. All right, the table three lists of the relationship between the voltage varies the devices. Note the unit until the generator reaches the 2500 amps of field one when field two voltage remains normal, but is soon, soon current exceeds 2500 volts of the field one and field two voltage immediately reduce. All right, this shows the current gen current current generator current current generator current amperes CP full fields um, 152 volts field one field loads two. Battery volts. All the battery volts for all um, current generator amperes are six six point oh. Um, in with the uh, and um, they're in each in a, each are in a selector position. Um, starting in selection position, idle you have C, zero CP field volts, and then from one thousand volts, uh, one thousand amperes are your um, eight selector valves. It rises one point until you get to about the uh, fourth or five fifth selector, and then it rises five point one, five point two, five point five, six point zero. Your 152 volts will stay at 5.0 amperes from the idle to um, selector 4. And then 5.1, 5.2, 5.9, 5.9, 9, 6.0 will also match the CP field volts. Your field 1, field 2 volts from selector idle to field, field um, fields, um, is the um, position of the selector 4. You have 1.0 volts and then from field volts we will go down 2559.8. 2600, 0 0.8, 0 0.8, 2750.5, 2950.1, and 3000.0. Remember, all the battery voltage is 6.0. Um, note that the high generator current will arrive at the generator will reduce the excitation voltage of the field 1 and field 2 volts. The illustrative the illustration action graphically note the current except for the 2500 volts to generate the field 1 and field 2 voltage reduce the 2500 amp at the point amp B with the field 1 field 2 volts is 100 amp volt. A 2600 amp um, field 1 field volt 2 field 1 field field 1 field 2 volts reduce to the A 0.8 the volts and so on. Figure 11 should not be interpreted to mean the generator current excess with the result of the decrease of field 1 field 2 volts. This means that instead that the excess of the current generator, the excitation voltage will reduce. This will reduce the um, to 
Generator current with a safe maximum value. The balance condition quickly reached for the just enough of the excitation to hold the generator load current at maximum safe load. All right, now going back over the drawings. Um, backing out to assume the page level. All right, this is a graphical representation of operation generator load current at limited circuit with the current um, circuit voltage represented with the varying vertical distances. Uh, your first ver um, reference voltage would be between your CP field, IR, drop less, and then reference voltage. Then, um, then your next, with an extension of rectifier blocking into the field one, field two, field one version, a little bit higher with the full voltage on field one, field two ver voltage, battery volts, and 152 going from um, reference um, to the amplifier exciter field. Um, note that the uh, CPI uh, IR drop same with the reference voltage from the um, pot head. Between the field number two, field number one, um, 152 volt is asshole battery voltage full drop at the F1 field, full voltage drop on 51 and 52. And then your CPIR greater than reference of the voltage, you have the rectifier wheel and going through a um, um, re um, fuse for the field one, field two, field one, um, 150 volt batteries. The CP field less than 152 volts, no effect on the field 1, field 2 voltage A, B, and the figure in 11. CP field B, um, seal field, um, seal field with 150 voltage, still no effect on the field 1, field 2 voltage point B. CP field higher than 152 voltage, field 1, field 2 voltage reduced, B, C, is B to C, figure 11. All right, the figure 11, the graphic representation data shown in table 3, generated the load current limit of the characteristics. This shows the voltage from 0 to 1.0 um, across field 1 and 2. Um, starting from 0, CPI field IRP drops at 5 point from 5, as, is uh, straight from A to B, 1 to 5, standard steady f at 5. Um, from at 5 to 6, it drops down descendingly at a... Um, at a slope of, uh, I guess... Uh, yeah, I guess it's about one or one to six. Rise and run one six. Um, generated motor field CP fields uh, field current with the armored amidine exciter with the two real stat um, real stators. With R2 and R2 rectifiers or R2 and R R3 the rectif um, resistant fielding. Um, field one field two current um 152 120 volt amperes of the rheostat of 120 or 125 in a battery positive and negative shows um the output voltage field current properly limited generator flow current um field properly limited at the top of the a and b gen where that was excitation at all right you're laminated iron core with the dc windings in the middle ac windings on the outside um the AC flux is on the outside. The DC flux um, it shows the uh, um, the uh, positive negative um, um, three to the three legged suitable with the core reactor lower drawings. Shows the distribution flux um, produced by the AC and DC windings. All right, I read that already. So we're on traction generator field current limited. The figure is well, but they illustrate the additional field current limited circuit with the prevent the overheating of the field generator field current. The field current is automatically reduced whenever the rise with the set value. A resistor RF is added with the field current, but the voltage drop with the current pair with the voltage of the 12052 resistor. Uh, just as the CP field volts were in, were in the figure eight with the field current exceeds the maximum safe voltage voltage of the, of the um, resistor RF will exceed the normal voltage of the re resistor. Um, 152 voltage of 152 excitation will reduce the reduction examine excitation will lower the field current to save the uh, to save value the r2 rectifier function for the same manner as it did with the r2 r3 in figure 7 to prevent the current for the exceeder fail current with the reaching of the generator field current during the periods of normal voltage of 152 um greater than the uh, of the um reduction field or the re rectifier or rf uh Deficiency in the system. The excitation system was developed to explain the regulating principle involved with the system. Usually, um, I actually use it. Certainly, the inherent deficiency with the prevent it being used in a locomotive. The traction equipment must be able to operate with one ground fault anyway. Whether a main circuit with the fault of the positive side of the generator would cover the parts of the domain with the circuit normally near the ground potential and cool the generator. The CP field is made the high potential for the reason of the dangerous interconnected with the main circuit. The main circuit with the low voltage battery with the control circuit with the necessary with the system described. The resistor generator field circuit which covers the considerable loss of the exciting power. Requiring large excitement as well as heating to the control compartment. The voltage drop across the generator CP field is actually only, only a fraction of the used in the example. The voltage across the generator CP field varies with the temperature as well as the current. Um, 
All right, suitable core reaction reactor system. The advantage of the suitable um, saturable reactor reactor system. They avoid the deficiency of the inherent with the DC system described above. The similar sim similar in principle to making the use of the isolating amplifier property to suit to suitable um, su 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 suitable co uh, saturable saturable core reactor. The purpose of the saturable core reactor is to produce the DC voltage with it. With using the rectifier pro proportional to the DC currents, we must control the DC voltages. Are usually exactly the same manner of the voltage. All the DC systems just describe the advantage of the voltage obtained with the greater allowing the more accurate control. No connection made between the battery circuit and the main circuit. With the addition of the means of the special temperature of the sensitive red resistor and the effect of the variation of the generator, the CP field voltage resisting with the temperature variation multiplied uh, nullified as so the voltage obtained with the more accurate indi indi indication of the actual generator load current through the uncompensated CP field voltage. Two sources of power. The alternating current power with the saturable core reactor system is furnished by the 400 cycle the alternator driving the, driven by the DC motor fed with the 740 volt locomotive battery. The transformer is used to furnish the power with the proper voltage of the each part of the line system of the system. All right, three suitable core reactors, saturable core reactors. Figure 13, 14, and 15. The brief review of the principle involved with the saturable core reactor may be helpful to be going on the complete system. The reactor you have here the three legs of the iron core with, with the AC coils on the outer legs, one or more DC winding with the center leg. With the C, the figure 318 with the AC winding with the density of the series in which wave the crave of the alternate flux and then outer part core of the without causing the ancient with the can center leg with the which for the DC coils are round, wound. And hence, the AC voltage does not induce the DC windings. However, the current with the DC windings create the flux of the iron not only with the center leg, but in all parts of the core, saturating the iron to such an extent that depending on the amount of the current with the DC winding, the using up the iron of the DC flux reduce the AC flux produced with the given current in the AC winding. The AC voltage across the reactor will proportional to the AC flux. Consequently, the given with the AC current with the voltage across the AC winding, the grief of the DC flux increase the will, increase the DC flux decrease. Um, figure 14 shows the wire diagram system sat, um, symbol with the saturable core reactor the marking with the DC winding D1, D2, D3, etc., indicating the relatively poor layer of the windings. Um, current in one over the winding of the outer number to the even number the, into the D1, D2, for example, would be add the DC flu flux pro proposed produced by the current from the outer even with another winding D3, D4. Current in the another winding the even number the end of the odd number and the item into D6 and, and D5, for example, would reduce the flux produced for the other windings. In this system, we are about to describe the two saturable core reactors are you with the, each of the currents with it to be controlled with the AC winding with the two reactors with the connected with the series across with the constant AC voltage figure C figure 15. The AC winding with one of the reactor XB with the connected with the resistor of the locomotive battery the current with this to be controlled bass through the DC winding of the reactor XA. Our right, figure 14 shows your um um, your AC DC windings um, D1 D2 um, D2 D1 D2 D3 D4 D5 CD6 um, systematic drawing, drawing diagram showing the saturable core reactor with the three DC windings DC windings sometimes shown with whatever the convenient with non the diagram instead of the some people are over the AC windings is shown in the above. All right, um, your control over the B and the real these have the um, D1 D2 um, X, XA XB AC proportional proportional number one constant AC voltage transformer um, alt 400 circulating al alternator cycle and the transformer to battery and alternating field the positive and negative um, and a, and a res, uh, arrangement of the um, pair suitable the core reactors obtaining AC voltage propor proportional to direct current control. Or the general load current limited with the means of the saturable cord um, to the motor's main generator, CP field positive and negative to the motor's the load current um, going from the um, CP field, the real status of 116, the D1, D2, which was the um, the windings, the DC windings, um, the cellium electrifier, the amp ampadane exciter, um, field 1, field 2, reserve 150 volts, 120 volts, real stat 125 125 battery, um, 400 cycle alternator, transformer T1, um, rectifier to, um, field winding, going to do 124 negative, um, 
Let us consider what happened to the bear with the DC chrome of the two. The reactor there is no chrome of the DC one. And gave the reactor there is no DC flux in either one of the IAC developed the equal between them. And if the DC chrome of the sum of the reactor, but reactors improved together with the DC flux in one of the reactors always the same as the other, the AC voltage will still divide equally between the two. How would the DC flux in XA increase without increasing the DC X and B? With the AC voltage will no longer divide equally. Reactor XA having the more DC flux in it will then um, have less C AC flux, so less than the ABC voltage will appear across the IC windings. Some of the AC voltage across the two reactors is fixed so that the AC voltage across XB must increase the voltage across XA to decrease. The increase in the DC flux in the XA will without changing the DC for the XB in the XB. This increases the AC voltage across the XB with the obviously greater the flux DC flux in the XB with the greater the DC flux in XA which must get the same as the AC voltage division. By connecting DC wind with the reactor, reactor the DC, XB with the cross of the battery is suitable the resistance here with the sufficient of the DC flux to produce the reduced AC voltage with the cross XB with the very low volt value. There is no DC XA. There is the current end of the DC winding XA increase with the AC voltage across the XB rises. AC volt across XB rectified with the means of the full, full wave cell the rectifier. Or resulting in DC, um, DC voltage, you uh, just if there was a voltage across the generator for the CP field with the drop across the resistor, um, and the generator field current with the output with the rectifier connected to the cross of the resistor 152 with the regenerator field with the current with the power with the load current as part of the XA chain with the current will have exactly the same effect as the amp-dime field volts as well as the voltage where they're usually directed. Um, generator load current limit the figure 16. Figure 16 shows the current limit of the saturated with the reactor with the rectifier instead of the CP field with the current to cross the resistor 152 compared with the figure 8 with the DC winding with the rectifier X1 um, reactor X1 the corresponding with the XA with the pre proceeding with the discussion with the dis uh, connected there Areas, taking across the um, generator CP field through the special resistor for the purpose of the special resistor for the compensator to increase the CP field the resistance, which causes the more voltage to drop with the same load current with the cause of the heating up of the generator under load. The result of the current with the DC winding with the X1 um, reactor, which is the always out proportional within the line of the current, the consequence of the voltage output for the current limited to rectify with the most uh, more accurate in, in indication of the current with the, the CP, full volt, CP full field voltage itself. The operating with the current limit of the course is exactly the same as the CP field voltage was directly with low current increase of the current with the DC winding of the X1 um, reactor increase the cause of the voltage rectifier of the R3 derived causing the voltage across the R resistor 152 to increase and leave less of the voltage amp dime field with this reducing the generator excitation. 5. The generating field current limit of the figure 6 to 17. Figure 17 shows the field limit of the saturable reactor with the rectifier substitute with the resistor generator field current circle with the DC winding of the X3 reactor of the reactor corresponding to the X1 with the load of the current with the XA with the previous discussion care the generator field current with the output voltage rectifier R2 with the proportional generator field current with the U with the regulated field current within the exactly the same way of the voltage drop with the field rectifier resistor figure 512. Alright, um, 6 AC with session sort for the figure 18, the output of the voltage 400 is like the MG series um, set with the effect of the sum of the variation of the battery the voltage set, the temperature of the variation, 400 cycle supply voltage will cause the AC voltage across the saturable re reactor to verify the node. Nothing of these were done, but this might cause the set of um, serious variation, the limiting sets of the variation. AC voltage across the reactor that can be caused to the head. However, they may be making the voltage across the amp dime field resistor with 152, verifying exactly with the same way with the balance between the voltage that is not affected. This is done by substance between the rectifier battery extension with the supply supplying it to the AC from the end of the winding of the same transformer supplying with the saturable reactor with the figure 18 with the fluctu fluctuation in the supply voltage appears but limited with the current circle with the amp dime field circle with the so did not affect the negligible with the delta reactor 164 helped to smooth out the ripple in the reflect, reflect, re react, rectified AC loading operation load control operational load control has not been affected with the substitution made with the original system figure 18 shows the complete the saturable reactor with the system that shown with the simplest form of the AC and the DC voltage were actually with the practical local of control with the indicated will be noted with the corresponding voltage with the corresponding with the higher than those used in the basic DC system originally described and higher voltage will also greatly accuracy with the control. Traction after figure 15, 19, 20, and 28. With addition, with protecting the generator without overheating too much of the, too much of the armature current with the current limiting, with it also serve with the control low, low, low speed traction after. On the first throttle, that's the current limit is reduced as well as the explained with the blow, but the uh, but just as uh, enough for the current to move the locomotive with the throttle handle with the pull back down, pulled back the current limit is the rate of little on the each of the notch, permitting the smooth the starting of the train and fill gen, pull full generation currents allowed with the highest notch of the C figure 19. 
The current limited reduced the lower notch with the change of the DC field winding current with the current limited saturable re reactor with the current is in with the DC winding with the X2 with reduced less current with the need with the reach of the, um, reach the DC winding with the X, um, X1 reactor because the AC voltage distribution across the reactors thereby reducing the excitation with the balance of the condition. Additional current is then put uh, through a second DC winding with the X1 reactor of the proper direction to aid the first D1 and D2 winding the um, DC winding. Um, the... The increased DC flux with the X1 current um, causes the more voltage with the cause of the X2 resistor 152, reducing the field 1 and field 2 amp down field current with the generator output drop with the D2, D1, D, um, DC, D1, D2 wheel, wheel, wheel winding current with the decreased enough to make up the additional circuit with the D3, D4 winding through the DC flux in the um, reactor X2. When the core condition is reached with the balance between the excitation output with the re output will be restored with the lower generator, the circuit chain with the give with the direct of that with the control with the figure shown in figure 20, the new DC winding with the current with the show, um, show some Simplified with the figure 28 with the notching resistor with the resistor 119 active the voltage divider with the pentameter on the highest throttle with the notch notching resistor with the open standard circuit with the result of the highest voltage across the DC windings of the X2 reactor lowest voltage across the extra winding X1 um, reactor with low nose with the resistor notching of the resistor degree for the three but reducing voltage D1 D2 winding X2 reactor and with across the D3 D4 winding of the X1 reactor the first notch with the notch resi res resistor shorted out and for the reducing the voltage across the DC winding with the X2 reactor at zero and the full voltage across the X1 DC winding current. This, of course, gives the lower generator load current, current limit setting. All right, now I'm going back to um, a couple drawings ago. All right. All right, um, you just shows your additional generator field current limiting unit, units. Um, you have your main generator positive, negative, the CP full of the load current with the uh, traction motor reels, um, re reactor, reactor verifier at 160 volts going to DD, D1, DC winding flux 1, um, reactor D1, 2, D1, 2, 2, and X3, X1 reactor D1, D2, X um, rectifier through R3, um, and then DC3, direct winding 3 and 4, and X, um, reactor X1, X4, um, rectifier D3, D2, um, they run to, to a transformer at 400 cycles at the locomotive alternator at um, field ampage of 125. The batteries run between 120 circuit and 125 volts, um, which was equal to 1 volt um, in the field while a series of the rheostat ampedine exciter. Uh, the complete suitable core reactor line limited system line, limit system in simplest form and important voltage is included. Um, you have your main generator my positive and negative approximately four volts of maximum between the um, the um, fielding um, of the D1 D2 exciter reactor one, D1 D2 um, reactor two, rectifier three, D1 D2 D3 D4 um, rectifier rectifier two R1 rectifying. Um, the 20, 20 volt DC um, from the uh, third field winding at the um, field from the transformer from the uh, four alternator to the rectifier one, turning with the resistor at the real stats um, and uh, 74 D volt and volt device from the locomotive battery um, to the locomotive battery, negative and positive. Our right, steps of maximum load current resulting in resetting of the load current with the limit on each notch step in power of the maximum voltage resulting in the operating engine of the different speed on each notch and the generator output curve with all the throttle notches. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Um, wrong way. Our additional traction effort to control with the multi-modulated um, multi generator load current limit. The, um, once again, you have your battery positive, battery negative, running through the uh, resistor uh, of 120 volts, uh, 22 volts at a field um, winding, um, and then um, running back through the rheostat of 125 on a circuit with a um, low battery locomotive. That you see the transformer 2-1 going from each rectifier 1, 2, and 3. Um, the core... Um, 
the uh, D1, D2, D3, D4 windings, um, this shows the different flux windings for the um, reactors, X1, X2, X3, X4, main generator, um, notching resistors, amplodyne, exciter field, 1 field, 2 volt, we're going from the real stats and on the circuit of another 102, um, All right, 20A, the DC winding circle involved with the traction after the Nash resisting maximum resistance at highest level of 119, one um, box squared, positive negative, battery locomotive 74 volt DC. On the bottom side, you have 156 um, rheostatted bolt volts and the Nash resistant volts at DC direct current winding X um, reactor 2, the winding 1, director, the um, reactor winding, uh, reactor winding 1, D3 and D4, 153. All right, bootstrap winding with added to the X3, increasing accuracy of the generator field. Um, main generator, once again, positive negative resistor, 117, also running through um, D field currents, uh, making up field currents D1 and 2, and D and 3 and 4, and rector 155, 190, 199, and 119, and um, so, um, Simplifies it between the uh, reactor X2, D1, D2 filing, Re resistor 3, um, or rectifier 3, rectifier 2, rectifier 1, all going to transformer 1, aluminum, uh, 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 alternator battery, 400 cycles, um, ampedine exciter generator field, which, um, and real stator 125, um, field winding F1 and 2, and locomotive battery positive and negative. All right, nine. Modified limit of the circle of the figure twenty-one. The DC, um, second DC winding is added with the reactor X three uh, X three with the improve of the accuracy with the generator field current with the limit of the figure twenty-one. The output current of the field reactor the rest of the eighth of the voltage growth of the reactor resistor one fifty-two path through the new DC winding D one and D two. Add the DC flux created with the generator field current with the first winding with the D three D four with additional DC flux X three cover the output of the increase of the term of the cover the more flux of the bootstrap the fact that it's not in, um, enough to identify the hour of the balance is quickly react. The small all increase with the generated field current with the cop the increase with the field rectifier output current, the increased current with the bootstrap landing with the reinforced original increase with the generator field current, thereby create for causing the further increase of the output with relatively small deviation. Generator field causing the large charge and rectifier output consequential and consequently the exact excitation with the result more accurate control of the field current thing obtained with the bootstrap winding. 10, um, figure 10, electrical braking, figure 22 and 22A, the electrical braking motor uh, armature of the disconnect with the generator will control connected with the cross of the brake resistor of the motor field with the current action with the series separately exists with the generator, the motor's active uh, generator taking part of the, um, of the drive with the converting with electrical energy which is dissipated with the brake resistor in the form of the heat. The amount of brake of the control with the operator mean with the braking the um, pentameter which is going to connect with the craft of the locomotive battery operated with the control of the selector handle with the generator load current with the limit of regulate for the motor field current with the generator output. Say the current limit is determined by voltage between the brush arm with the one end of the pentameter and the brush with the arms connect with the train line with the same current limit with the train units are running with the two or more units with the multiple of the current limit that holds low mo motor Field current with the train line voltage low with the rate of the motor field the current with the train line voltage is raised. Current limiting circuit with the rearrange for the braking of the mains, um, making the um, means for the braking relay with the rearrangement of the necessary because of the extremely range of the required but from zero to full motor field current with the same the sufficient air frequency with the controls to ensure the same braking of all the units over the full range of motor field current. The circuit with the braking are shown with the figure 22 with the simplest schematic diagram of the figure 22A with the show of the current sighting of the circuit involved with the DC winding X1, X2 but the diagram has been rearranged. Show the clear of the circuit function with the brush arm with the braking pentameter with this also zero end therefore no voltage across the X2 um, reactor winding of the sufficient current flow for the voltage of the divide, divider 165 and 165A through the um, di um, di direct winding 3 and 4 um, the reactor X1 to reduce the amplitude excited to zero with no current of D1, D2 winding. This is, of course, result of the zero motor field current. As a pentameter, but the rotate with the getting of the brake with the voltage curve, the X2 reactor with the grief with the current with the D3 and D4 winding, DC winding with the X1 um, reactor decrease, the decrease current with the D3, D3 and D4 reduced over the DC flu, um, flux with the X1 
thereby increasing the amperdyne ex excitation of the generator output of the motor field current with the increase of the current with the D1, D2, 1, and cross the generator CP field with the increase enough to make up the drop of the D3, D4 current, increase with the current DC winding with the X2 reactor. This is the same as what happens in the monitor with the breaking the increase with the further one of the different appearance um, of the action current with the setting of the circuit. Um, in the breaking the way, way, way it works, monitoring the D3 and the D3 winding that's connected with the voltage divider 165 and 165A, so it always is less than full battery potential. All right, the braking potentiometer rotated with the potential of, the, of its brush with the arm and higher with the potential of the voltage divider for the current of the D3, D4 winding with the re, um, reverses for the current is created for the first direction for the braking potential of the voltage and create the voltage. The first current with the exposed with the current with the D1, D2 winding the current current across the CP field with exactly with the same as the flux of the DC, D3, and D4 current field, um, current before it is reversed. That is, they reduce the DC flux from the X1 reactor cover the excitation generator output to rise until the new balance condition is obtained. The maximum generator Output that has been during the braking is left than one third of what is the motoring owner or the order to get about, um, about the same current of the D1 D2 winding of the X1 reactor on both conditions. The part of the resistance here of the winding is shorted out during the braking by an interlocking on the braking switch. The interlocking is shown across the cross of the resistor 116 in figure 23. Our figure 22 shows the generator load current limit of the um, circuit re reconnect with the electrical braking arm. Here, if you braking potentiometer with 165 amperes going, um, splitting in between the both the reactor one and reactor two. Reactor one shows the D1, D2, D3, D4, D5, D6, all DC winding fluxes. Um, DX the side of two is then brought in the circuit with um, the direct windings into a D1. Um, the reactors from X1, X2 go into the reactor, reactor, reactor fire 3, which goes through the type 1 alternator 400 cycle, and then from the, the same thing with the reactor fire 2, except for their loop with the ampedine exciter um, in the field current, um, positive negative, um, which is also on the outside of the uh, um, direct winding 2, um, goes in the field current. Um, Goes to field current one five field um, field winding one and two, and real stators one fifty two one twenty rectifier one and um, one twenty five real stat one hundred sixty field winding uh, one hundred twenty two volts battery local one of battery and south. All right, a DC winding circuit is involved with electrical braking. Braking pedometer, the maximum braking zero to maximum, um, 15062 rectifier, um, D3, D4 winding of the X1 rectifier, 165, 165 amp um, rectifier, both 74 volt low amount of battery negative and one D1, D2 for the DC winding and D3, D4 for X1, X2. Um, to increase the accuracy of the third DC winding with the D5, D6 with the add of the X1, this winding acts is exactly the same there as the second of the D1 and D2 um, winding of the field limit of the reactor of the core reactor X2 with the X3 describing motor field limit of the circuit. 11. Complete amplitude excitation system, figure 23. The complete saturable reactor amplitude control system is shown, figure 23. Several new circuit components that have been added with the required the explanation. All proceeding with the diagram, notching resistor setting for the maximum low current of each of the throttle notch has been shown, um, shown simply with the var variable the resistor. Multiple unit operation locomotive required for the relays operated from the train lines to set with low current limited on all the cab, therefore. These relays AFB and BFS, CVS, and DVS are operated with the proper sequence link for the value of the notching resistor. The A step of the throttle of the notch top. Resistor 157 and 157A are put with the bootstrap of the winding with the D5, D6, and the reactor X1, D1, 2, and X3. To prevent trouble, the AC voltage with the N2 for the DC winding reactors will operate with the reactor for the high flux density with the resistor partially short circuit. The DC winding so far that the AC isn't concerned with thereby keeping the straight AC flux for the center of the DC leg with the re after the DC resistance of the bootstrap line is more lowly, much lower than those um, than that of the resistors. However, the, um, there are little um, there are little of little circuit with an output shown with across the winding of the straight AC voltage is not what kept them at um, minimum would be um, density density sensitive limited limits can circle the perhaps each of the dangerous values maybe in in terms of the windings no circuit much resistors are needed for the reactor two and reactor four but the cover the DC windings are low enough for the AC be independent to be included keep a ripple voltage down to the safe value. 
Field winding three and four. Um, Amplidine field winding with the connective lacrosse with the Amplidine armature with the winner with the relay EF does not energize the polarity of connection with the truss with the armature voltage is caught with the current with the field winding three and four with the field winding proper the direction with the roof of the bolts to prevent the resulting field by the Amplidine exit of producing the generator with the excitation whenever the not winding with the EF the relay with the energizer during the normal operation the exit the field winding F3 and F4 with it usually referred to as the suicide field. Field winding seven and eight Amplidine field with the stabilizing stabilizing capacity during the normal operate monitoring motoring operations of they are lowly compared with the result would be required during the braking and most because of the amplitude voltages is much higher during the motoring because making the capacity um, capacitation more effective with additional capacitation is connected during the braking means for the um, braking relay um, relay BR2. All right, difference between the figures in the locomotive diagrams. Figure 23 has the built-in um, step to the step of the start of the figure 15 and adding with the two part of the time of the single basic circle with the surcharge reactors is shown in figure DC winding superimposed AC windings. To see how the certain um, circuits actually function for the clear of the most cl um, case with the schematic only portion of the reactor cable for the associated with the resistor being right, by, um, which belong with the one circuit of the one electrical circuit to show, to show other circuits with the same reactor and other locations wired to gram with the natural fit with the electrical circuit with the proceeding with the figure 20A and 22A were made in the manual. On the mobile with the wired to gram, so these for extra, for, for extra wires for the purpose of other excitation exact, 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 exactly as shown in figure 23, the appearance are differently because they are shown schematically as comparison will read show that the connection is shown in figure um, 23. 23 is exact as follows. Each of the coil reactors is shown properly labeled whenever the logically goes in the electrical circuit. The positive side of the exciter is shown with the top and instead of the bottom. The same is to be more um, nearly and instead of under practice can be done with the schematic mode with the max minimum number of the cross wiring. The order in which the parts are shown is slightly different. Um, this is the next one. If you haven't figured these out, these are building on each other. Um, um, the new one on this page is your new field windings one, um, um, past one, two, three, you got three, four, five, six, and seven, uh, eight, uh, your switching board, um, your, um, your, uh, notching resistor relays, um, for the AV, CV, DVS, BVS, um, these are all relays, uh, for the, which we're basically talking about speed control. All right, this I'm going to have to back out of. This is a regulating control system. You have the load control um, going on a fuel injunction pump, um, fuel pump, um, con uh, cam, clutch coil, operating travel spring, stabilizing rheostat, li flu li flu fuel limit the coil, fuel limit pilot valve, um, slave piston, slave piston number one, number two, inlet port, reference spring, rectifier, four, fuel limited resistor, f t um, tech generator. Section three, power. Section three, power plant regulation system for locomotive equipment with the um, 17 MG3 governor.